Hello everyone! I am back with a um, rather short tech video uh, because I posted a Facebook post today and thought why not make a short video of it also so it can reach more people. And the content is about a Squirling Thrustmaster T300RS racing wheel and what I did to fix the issue. There are more videos showing off this issue on YouTube already but not so many answers of how this damn squirling can be quiet down. I bought my Thrustmaster T300RS about two years ago and the last six months I have beginning to hear this noise. Not so much when driving with my headset on, but it was a distraction anyway. This must be a sort of a manufacturing issue, so I could try open a support case at Thrustmaster, but even if they would have sent me a replacement base unit, I still had to send in my current units to the reseller. So I believe digging into the issue myself is the best and fastest way after all. Also, I don't have any guarantees that the replacement unit that Thrustmaster perhaps would have sent me will not have the same problem. I started by removing about six small screws on the chassis so the top cover could be taking off and after that I realized I need to go all the way with this one because I could not see or do anything to get rid of the squirting sound at that point. One tip that I read about was just trying to tighten the screws on the front around the hub but I tried that and there were no luck there. I just hate to remove cables from my sim rig because it is a pain to put them back again but I had no choice so after losing the base unit from the wheel plate I could continue my investigation. I removed about six more screws and the front cover was taking off and the belt system was now clearly visible. The electronic is on the other side so no worries about damaging things but I must state that doing this repair or maintenance on your own are surely ending your warranty. Think about that. But if I can fix the issue I will know what to do if it comes back later on. I detached some kind of belt tension plate and after that I tested putting on some additional grease lubrication on the shaft on the bottom right and voila! The squirting noise went away immediately. So I guess the grease lubrication applied from Thrustmaster is not enough. The end of the shaft on the front was clearly scratching dry at the black plastic. I don't have any guarantees that this completely will solve the issue, but for now at least, it is all gone. Putting the unit together again was a no-brainer, and if you are uncertain about uh, doing this, just take some pictures under the way so you know how it all looks like and are fitted together. Altogether I spend roughly two hours doing this, and if the damn squirling sounds are coming back, I will post a comment below and following up this issue. Hope you found this video helpful and please take a look at my other tech videos here on my channel and I hope see you all in more videos to come. Bye for now!